Hello everyone, welcome to the King David Podcast. So today we're going to be talking about many things. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm eating ice cream. Ice cream is a super popular food here in America, especially here in Florida where I live. Super popular food. If anyone's wondering in the video, why is there chewing noises? It's mean. Simply because I'm just eating an ice cream. It's your answer. Sorry about the break, guys. I'm just eating an ice cream. And, yeah, that's why I'm taking the break. History lesson, guys. The origin of Christmas. The origins of Christmas stem both the pagan and Roman cultures. The Romans actually celebrated two holidays in the month of December. The first was Saturnalia which was a two-week festival honoring their god of agriculture, Satan. Another history lesson, guys. The first recorded date of Christmas being celebrated on December 25th was in 300 in the year 336 during the time of the Roman Emperor Constantine and it's now a public holiday in many parts of the world and y'all celebrate it differently here in America we do Christmas trees and we give cookies to Santa other parts of the world you guys just do it differently another history lesson right here the Christmas tree originated in northern Europe And, uh, guys, uh, something, something I kind of wanted to address on my channel is that anyway, 
if y'all are wondering, can I make better content? Well, yeah. The well, the answer is yes. But as you could see, I used to have a phone, and now I don't have it. Cause I got a new phone, and now I don't know the account to my YouTube. So for me to make better content is possible, but will require a lot of work. So, well, yeah, that's basically the only th the thing I wanted to address. And guys, interesting fact. Christmas started in Rome about the year 336. But it didn't become a Christian festival until the 9th century. Also, guys, I wanted to mention about the Gold Coast. This is actually the area where Miami, Fort Lauderdale, and West Palm Beach are. Uh, I'm from the Gold Coast, Tam Miami to be specific. Tam Miami is a town east, actually west of Miami, bordered by the Everglades. And it is about a couple miles south of the Broward County line. It is a very interesting little town, but I didn't grow up in Tam Miami. I mostly grew up most of my life in Cutler Bay. So about the Gold Coast, the Gold Coast is is one of the regions in the U.S. state of Florida. Uh, that this the uh, Gold Coast is the region where I'm from. And it's one of the several coast regions of Florida. Also, the nature coast. I have been to this area. And it's a very good area. I went to... I forgot the name of the city. But it was in the nature coast. When I went to Ocala this year, it was Crystal River, which is in Florida's nature coast.
he drew him. So you're supposed to say yes and no, not me. Uh, guys, pardon that. Anyways, getting back to the podcast. Sorry that I go a little quiet sometimes. I'm a quiet person sometimes. And don't mind that noise if you guys hear it. It's just a therapy, so don't mind that, guys. I'm being very serious. Don't mind that. Uh, So, guys, I want to mention that there are many weird cities in Florida. We actually have a city named Sebastian and Vero Beach. I've never been to Sebastian and Vero Beach, but you do somewhat pass by the area on Florida's Turnpike, despite that it is far. I can tell you that. About uh, two-ish hours away. No, I think it's a little more, about two and a half hours away, almost three hours. So, Sebastian is in Indian River County, which is about two and a half hours away from us, I think. And it's at the confluence of the St. Sebastian River. And the Indian River, which I don't know what rivers are those because I never heard of them. And it is only two miles away from the Atlantic Ocean. Pretty close. And guys, they actually have a resort in Vero Beach, in a Disney resort, but I've never seen it, obviously. And it opened on October 1st, 1995. I wouldn't remember that because I wasn't born in 1995. That was 26 years ago. Long, long time ago. I wasn't even born yet. People who would have remembered are people like you guys, uh, people born at least 70s. You guys probably would have remembered 60s. You guys might have remembered. That's if you lived in Florida. Uh, I'd like to go to this Vero Beach resort, Vero Beach Disney Resort someday. It would be a a blessing to go to this resort someday. It would be a great opportunity.
So Sebastian, Florida is called home of Pelican Island, Sebastian, Florida. And this is, well, Andrew P. Canova, a Florida settler and author of Life. Author of Life and Adventures of uh, in South Florida. I don't know why I just freaked out. I thought the mic was about to fall. I must be exaggerating. What are those? All right. Uh, this is all uh, from the podcast. I hope you have a nice day. Episode two is coming out very soon on November 1st. So stay tuned for that. Actually, November 5th is when it's coming out. So stay tuned. Have a nice day. And... Yeah, have a nice day. So, see ya.